Hey you guys, KLG86, AK Raymond. I just got off work. Welcome to another reaction video. My juggernaut. My girlfriend is losing the house. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. Her house, actually. It's kind of crazy how this is gonna go. And from the looks of it, guys, Psycho Dad is giving Jesse a little pep talk on about what's what's gonna be like living here. So can't wait to see how this is gonna turn out. So let's take a look and see. Yeah, why you're editing when he was supposed to edit? Cause I. I just said, I know how to edit better. I've been doing it longer and I'm showing that I'm... I don't understand why you're editing when he was supposed to edit. I just said, I know how to edit better. I've been doing it longer and I'm showing that I'm doing something. I'm not just freeloading. Yeah. As shifty as you are, now you're helping me out. I'm not shifty. I'm not... What? You're always shifty. You're always going around doing stuff. Oh, I'm barging in. Right. My house, I'm barging in on you. Look. Just do me a favor. Would you a little favor? Okay. Okay. We need people in that house. So at least if you would put it out. your house. So just... Right. I'm asking you to put it out. Put what? Put it out. Tell the people. You are on your face. You just told them that in the video that I edited. It doesn't matter. I need more people. I make more money. You remember? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You remember? You owe me money. Yeah, so the more people that okay, are right, paying, paying money, you're paying, you're paying me off quick. And you're paying me for promotion. All right, hey guys, Rigid House, or my dad's going to Hustler House now, because apparently it's like a freaking prostitution it's ring. Fair How, you drink. How much is it? Thousand dollars a month. Thousand dollars a month. It's fair because you're not paying utilities. They don't have that kind of money, Dad. But okay, thousand dollars a month for all you fans, all the juggies out there. Come on over. They got you guys got to do chores and stuff. Whatever my dad wants. So you pretty much just bitch. Yeah, yeah you uh, hit the nail on the head there. Chores. Look, I'll mow the lawn tomorrow. That's it's it. It's a content house, though, Dad. It's a content house, and that's great. Look, you've got the opportunity to work with a bunch of YouTubers. you got a place to create, right? Yeah, my dad's right? the biggest YouTuber of them all, so you get to collab with him. Are you done? I yeah, created I'm big jugger nuggets. Yeah, so oh, I am. Yeah. Right, so, right. so you got a house to promote, create, and do this. you got other YouTubers. Right, $1,000 a month, three rooms left. There may be a fourth. Can you do your sales pitch somewhere else? Because I would like to get back to work. I'm promoting Bridget House on Twitter. Okay, good. Promote it for the family, right? Yeah, remember, remember the family? Think about yes, it. Of course. Right. Jesse, that's not right. Shut your mouth, Nick. What are you doing? Keep it down. Keep it down. Just let me in. What are you doing? Don't let me in. Okay. I don't really want to do. Right, I know. Shut your mouth. 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 Yeah. Here, here. Let me in. Okay, just keep your voice down. Are you all right? Wait, no, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. What do you mean? Because, Dad, my dad's selling the house. So I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Dad, what? He's selling the house, Jess. I, I didn't know that. Like, I didn't know either. So I have no place to go. The place that I've lived in for like 15 years, he's selling uh -huh. it. So I don't know where I'm supposed to be myself. I don't know where I'm supposed to be. What does that happen? What does that happen? Like within the next two weeks. Okay, you have your stuff now? I have some stuff in okay, my well, car. I need, I need to get it all out. I can't bring it in here. Because my dad knows you're in here. He's going to start talking to you in. I don't even know where I'm supposed to sleep, Jess. Okay, well you can't. I don't know what you want. What do you got? Dress or something? Yeah, they're close and stuff. Alright, well you can't bring it here. And uh, you definitely can't bring it to Jersey. I'm supposed to make it. What did dad say? He's going to have to get it all out in like a week. Okay, but where do you expect you to put it? I have no idea. I told him with the PA house. He can't. He can't. Well, he can't. He can't bring it up. He can't bring it up. I didn't want to tell him. That's the truth. But I told him I just can't do that. Okay. It's okay. Oh shit. That's weird. Can't see it. 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 Can't see what? Look me in the eye. Did she shit or did she uh, fart? Did she do anything? Yeah, she. Sh it smelled really bad. Yeah. You wouldn't lie to me, would you? No. Who are you lying about dogs' farts, Dad? Look at her. She's Why would like, you open the window? I got the air conditioner on. Right you know, my electric bill went down like three times when you and your brother left. Right, so well, I've, I've been luxurily having a thousand dollars the freaking window alarms. 
Would you shut the alarm? Okay. I got the arrow. That's all I'm asking. Thank you. Yeah, it's that it. easy. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right. Yes. What the hell? You all right? Oh. No. Oh, by the way, why do you have a cameraman in here? He was, I don't know, I don't, he doesn't listen to me anymore. Nick, follow me, please. Okay. Okay. Alright? Yeah. Alright, I've been watching some of the videos. Uh -huh. Why are you keeping on him? Because, I don't... No, yeah. I like some of your uploads. You do a great job. The, uh, the last one, though, when, when you were promoting Tiffany, why can't yeah. we do it for like a split second? I don't know, I just figured... If all these people are going to come to this house, you've got to promote the people that are in the house, right? Okay, yeah. And now we need Jesse to start promoting the house, right? we got to get uh -huh. his viewers over, your viewers, or Janice Squad, whatever the case may be, when uh -huh. we take over everything and everything's in my name, right? So, okay. we've got yeah, all those people that. promote... What do you mean, I don't know about I don't know about you doing, doing that to my channel. I'm not talking so much about your channel, but Jesse's followers need to come over to me, right? Yeah. Right. Because he's not doing anything. Uh -huh. It doesn't matter anymore to him. He okay. doesn't care anymore. All right. So I think the promotion of all these sites or all these, you know, YouTube accounts mm -hmm. will bring people in. Okay. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Now all next time we're going to take shit. So, okay. Laura, I think it's time to cut. All right. And there you go. Jesse, where's Ashley? I told her to go home. We'll figure it out. It's not now. What are you doing? <sighs> I don't know. I have a feeling Storyfire is coming back, guys. Just reminiscing, I guess. Yeah, Brian, I started this thing five years ago. It was a lifetime ago, and I guess it didn't work out. So. I mean, just last year we were doing a marketing push, and we thought it was going to be the biggest thing, and now here we are. It failed now. Lost so many back so. Back Yeah, come on. Yeah, it sucks. Yeah, see. Stop. Stop this. Stop acting like this. I'm not. I'm not acting. Nick. Oh, yeah. My company. Brian Moore. Come on. I think it's the audience. You have like, like, just sound like you, the audience. You're about yeah, to hang no a broken record, Nick. Dude. It's because, because of this. It's because of all the things. Because of the content. I'm just saying, it's dude. Not, they're all about money. No, it's not about money, Jesse. And you don't believe I'm me? I'm just saying, since you hired me two years ago, I didn't know I was getting hired by a liar. The f did you just say? A liar. That's all you are. You think that of me? What's like, I'm doing some kind of f***ing asshole that's... What's going on? Keep it down. Your dad's sleeping. What are you doing in here? I don't have to sign this. So, so I figured you want to generate more sales, so I'll sign a poster so people want to buy it. But Jesse, that's an old poster. I mean, like, it's like nobody buys these old posters. That's why I was going to sign it. Get people interested again. One poster. Generate some revenue, yeah. Jess, look at all these posters. Okay. Psycho series. Five years ago. I know when it was. We just said the five years Documentary. Uh-huh. Ursula. Christmas. Yeah. MBE. Okay. Those, it was all. They're all old posters. Nobody wants old posters. They, they want, they like want new stuff. Oh. I mean, like. I what is this? This is about money? You, you think you're going to get money for an old uh, story? Yeah, yeah. It's been about money. You made enough content. You may tell enough stories. People want more. And then you get more money. So. And then you're going to be happier? You're going to be happier if you get more money for these posters? No. I think when you were doing these, when you were doing two uploads a day, you had such passion, Jess. Such passion. And yeah, all of these, you were just, it, you just, you were relevant. You were important. Yeah, the Christmas a lot of those you were, were from the same year. It, had it was 2016. Okay. Okay. Christmas so I was the same year. And the E was in 2016. It was still a few years ago, okay? I get it. It was the past. And where'd you have And now I need money. So this is the present. And you were happy. I was a kid then. 
And now I am grown up and I have bills to pay. It's all the things I've been told. So that's all I need right now is some cash to pay my debts. Well, you had money. You had money. And what did it get you? Nothing. Didn't get you happy. Money didn't get you happiness. That's the point. You bought a two. You bought a one point something million dollar house. Just you just want to be like everybody else. But I can't, like I said before, guys, money can't buy happiness. Oh, you'll be so happy. It never had. It never will. So. Remember. Jeff really, really likes you. He's very fond of you. Mm -hmm. Easy come, yeah. easy go, guys. Now he said that. Else. I mean, you're done because he's he's going to sleep. Said. So yeah. you're done. Well, so I figured, you can leave. Uh, I mean. Maybe yeah, I figured I'd get some B-roll. Uh, a few shots for the video before I leave. And life. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Bills, he's very excited rent, that everybody's rent, channel's going to be Psycho Dad channel, and um, he's just excited sure for the future. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and ideas, and, and he really enjoys your company. He talks. So, he talks really well about you. So you know. Yeah. So yeah. you can finish up and uh, let me unplug these lights. Okay. Uh, I don't think he's coming back in. So. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Have a good night, Nick. You too. I mean, she makes a good point. Yeah. Jesse. 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 What are you doing now? Dude, here? I need to talk to you. After the shit you pulled upstairs, I don't mean? have a word to no, say. I just need to talk to you. Well, You're gonna have to go crazy. crazy. He's psycho dad, Nick. No, what else is there? my channel from Jesse to psycho dad. I don't know what to do. Okay. I don't give a Bro, dude, come on. No, well, how do you expect me to care? You literally just berated me upstairs. You think I'm a liar? Source of money, bro. Oh, I'm not you know I'll help you. Really? No, I'm lying. Oh, dude, come on. My... What is that? Can I come out of here? Oh, oh my god. Shit, dude, you're, you're such, such a liar. liar. What were you doing in that safe, Jesse? It's not your business, bro. Go upstairs and film him. No, what are you guys doing? Yeah. What are you in here? Jesse. What were you doing with the brown bag? Was there anything in there? No. What are you guys doing? Yeah. Yo, y'all are both liars. Y'all are both liars. Your whole relationship is fake. You're a liar. What do you mean? That whole thing's fake. You're a liar. Could you get out of your face, bro? No. First off, I'm going to give you one last chance right now. One last chance to pay me. You're shaking, bro. Yeah, pay me. I don't have money to give. You have to. Take that this up with me, man. I need money. You owe, you owe me. You owe me. I swear to you, you have to all talk, bro. Well, I'm all talk. Why don't you check my channel tomorrow, Jesse? Not really. Uh, what's the worst? Clip, Jesse. What do you mean? It's way worse than the clip. Way worse than the clip. Nick, it's way worse than the clip, Jesse. You don't regret anything that you do. No, you're gonna regret anything that you do. Guess what? Guess what? Check my channel, bro. Subscribe or yes. Subscribe. No, I ever want that said. Yeah. Okay, you get out of my face. Start drama I'm like starting that. drama. Do you owe me money. I'm doing it. Check my channel tomorrow, Jesse. Oh, oh. Yeah, okay. Bye. So, what? Is this a huge bag? Check out my channel tomorrow. Yeah, okay. Whoa. I promise you won't regret it. Oh, guys. Oh, ho, ho. Is it strange that Ashley found that brown bag just like Psycho Kid? Boy. Is it just me, or is Ashley and Jesse acting like uh, a psycho kid and psycho girlfriend? <laughs> now he's saying that the the relationship's fake. So wait a minute, and now you know he, like I said before, guys. I'm sorry I talked over the the mom and everything, but she made a good point. Look, Psycho series lasted two years, and then in 2016, in 2016 after. Well, look. At, at, without out, at, after the um, after that, we've had um, the after the psycho series, we had uh, a Halloween series, Spirit of Ursula, and then we had the Christmas series, and then in 2016. No, actually, no. I'll take that back. I apologize. The 16, 2016. That's when the psycho series was over, and then we've had um, the Christmas series and the haunted series. And in 2017, which was four years ago, at, yeah, four years ago, take that back, four years ago, we started to have the devil inside, where we had, where we had Isaac, we, we've seen the birth of Isaac, we've seen everything that came across that from season one, uh, season one of the devil inside, we've seen how Isaac went back to his world. 
In season two, we seen we seen Jesse come back from the mirror world, and they we found out he's the devil. And then in 2017, uh, at the at the in uh, November or December, I want to say November or December, either one of those days, m months actually, we've seen the de we've seen the birth of NVE, my virtual escape, which lasted all the way till 2018 of Ju June or July. And what's crazy about that, then we've seen season three of The Devil Inside where Jesse uh, had problems. Uh, he needed to find a home. He needed to find a house to live in. And that was the tough part. Then in 2018, we, he decided to go buy a house and that's what he did <clears throat> within that year. And then last year, we've seen how they got the house and everything was perfect and everything. We've seen him like more. We've seen more. We've seen him get him a new cameraman, which was Nick, which was in 2008, 2019. And then when 2020 rolled around, that's when the that's when shit hit the fan, guys. That's where COVID 19 hit. They had a building. They had to close it down. Everyone had to stay secluded in their homes. And that was crazy. That's what happened a lot. And then after that, when Storyfire came along. I think that's the reason why people didn't like Storyfire so much because you had to do the video applications. You had to uh, try to get in, and write stories, but people want to do videos. He wanted, as Jesse stated, he promised everybody that he was going to give us a platform where you can tell your stories, do videos the right way without being blocked by YouTube and everything. But that didn't turn out very well. And as you guys know, after that big market push, you know, big, big YouTubers coming in and everything. That kind of tells me right there that this is not working out. And I, oh, you know, I need a trim. I just noticed that. I look like a, <laughs> I, I noticed that this is, I got long hairs here. Sorry. But then after that, that's when all things were going downhill. I mean, they couldn't do videos. I mean, Jesse quit YouTube in, in the start of, of January 2020 so he could pursue Storyfire. And then we haven't seen much of his videos on Storyfire lately. Then after that, we, he gave it to Psycho Dad, and then after that, he begged for his channel back. And then he had to start paying everyone, even Swift. Then after that, we've seen him do uh, the, the, the competition. We've seen how Nick became the, the cameraman, obviously. And then after that, we've seen how at the end of, end of it, he decided to close Storyfire. That was crazy. So the clip. So, it's crazy that Jesse is trying to break through the safe and try to find money. I'm like, what is he acting like? Why is he acting like Psycho Kid now? Is he really desperate for money in order to pay for it, pay everything? But all I know, guys, the one thing I, I find very unusual is that why would, psych, why would uh, Ashley hide in the Psycho room and then all of a sudden find that brown bag... So I think we're I think this is gonna be a mix between the devil inside and the psycho series again. I would say uh, the the uh well it's called the devil inside. What if it's called the psycho inside? I would like that. I would like that. The psycho inside. We're seeing how uh, psycho kid is really is like desperate for money and try to find a place to live, and now he's dealing have to deal with the devil soon. So, well, the psycho kid's gone. We all know that. But I have a feeling, judging from how he changed the reality, said Swift sent the money to psycho in the psycho series world from Psycho Kid Kills Father, which he didn't do. All realities changed. So, what if, guys, we're we're seeing a new reality that has been has been altered, and it has changed. You know why I'm saying this, guys? This, I'm saying this because. Ever since I watched the, the, that show Loki every Wednesday, which I find ironic that I find it funny that because I find it ironic because this is actually starting to look like Loki's like show. Because as you guys know, uh, spoiler alert: if you guys don't want to hear it, uh, just stop, just pause, and just skip, skip, skip. I'll make a hand gesture like this and let you know it's done. Okay, here we go. In in the show Loki, they uh, they ha he goes into a place called the time time variant agency where people where timekeepers actually control time and somehow 
uh, Loki, as you guys know, Loki was from the Avenger universe, and he just found out that his mom died, and he got killed by Thanos. So after what happened, he finds out that there's another time variant out there trying to change change everything, and it was Loki himself. But then he later finds out it was a girl. But as time goes by, she accidentally sent a bomb, and now there's various, like multiple, uh, he, she made the multiverse, where different timelines are spewing out of control. And now he's got to try to figure out to fix it. So, what, what I believe in right there is that I think Jesse's kind of using this type of story because I have a feeling that, I mean, is it strange that he decided to move back with his parents? That's like Psycho Kid all over again. Or it could be that, I'm not sure. But now we have a Psycho Girlfriend, which is Ashley. And judging from that, it, now, guys, now, now he's actually, now Jesse's got two people that is gonna that is getting on his butt. Shallow's gonna sue him for everything that he's got, and now Nick is actually going to is threatening Jesse that he's going to put uh, put the clip that Je that that Jesse doesn't want him to put up. Now the question is, what is so bad about this clip? I have a feeling it's got to be something that happened that happened in. Um, uh, Cost, uh, I, I, damn it! I, I actually, uh, I, I forgot what that place they went to now. Uh, uh, something the Punita. Blah. Anyway, that that I somewhere in the in the Dominican Republic, I guess. So and where Lance was. So I have a feeling whatever happened there after that argument, because after when the when the proposal failure happened, I have a feeling that. After the after when Ashley said no, something happened over there, and I have a feeling that Nick knows. Oh, wait a minute. How does Nick know that? Oh wait a minute. Jesse told him about that clip, and he said, "Made sure you delete it." Or, or I have a feeling that maybe um, it's about him stealing. I don't know. We'll find that out soon. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more reaction gameplay. Drop some likes if you enjoyed this. Time for me to have my dinner. Have a good day, guys, and don't forget stay positive.